Welcome to another mathematics class with Ms. Damilola. Today, you'll be learning about factors. I know you've heard of factors and some of you, I know you're familiar with the word factors, but listening carefully, we make you to learn a lot and know a lot about factors. What are factors? What do you understand by, by factors? Factors are numbers that are multiplied together. Numbers that are multiplied together to get another number. Look at this example, two times three. Two times three are numbers multiplied together, right? To give you six. So two and three are factors of six because they are the numbers multiplied together to get six. Finding factors is not difficult at all. So how do you find factor? Think of number that multiply together to get a certain number. Like number that you can multiply together. Like you are giving four. How can we get four? Which number can we multiply together? Just think of two times two. And how can you get the number so quick? So you make use of multiplication chart or multiplication tables. Let's look at this example. Factors of six. How can you get the factors of six? Now, one times six will give you six. Two times three will give you six. Three times two will give you six. Six times one will give you six. Look at the numbers multiplied together to give you the answer six. So the number multiplied together are the factors of six. One, two, three, and six itself. As you can see, one times six and six times one will give you six. Two times three and three times two, it is still the same number multiplied in different ways. And it gives you the answer six. Example two, the factors of eight. What numbers can you multiply together, together to give you eight? So we have one times eight, we give you eight, right? Two times four, we give you eight. Four times two, we give you eight. And eight times one, we give you eight. Look at the numbers multiplied together to give you eight. These numbers are the factors of eight. We have one, two, four, and eight. They are the factors of eight. It's practice time. Let me see what you've learned so far. So let me know what you've learned so far. To find the factors of this number, do not forget that it's you look for the numbers that can be multiplied to give you 4, 9, and 12. Thanks for watching. See you in the next class. And do not forget, if you have any question, you can write it down in the comment section. Bye. And make sure you don't miss any of this lesson. Okay? Bye.